God damn it, I can't keep a straight face. Alright, guys. What's going on? Whoop whoop. It's your boy. Juggalo Dragon. Gaming and more back. With some and more stuff, you know? Uh, today, as you can tell by the title of the video, I'm going to be dipping some Stoker's Mint Long Cut. So without further ado, oh shit, I already dipped a little bit of this, oh my god, yeah, that smells like a York peppermint patty, motherfucker, dude, there we go, why do I have the hairstyle of Justin fucking Bieber? right now. Now I look like Donald Trump. The fuck? Whatever. I, I legit look like Donald Trump. We're going to build a wall. Wait. We're going to build a great big beautiful wall. And the Mexicans are going to pay for it. <laughs> yeah, fucking right. They got their own fucking problems. Eh. That's the fucking one right there, baby. There we go. Do something with this fucking hair, am I? My hair is naturally curly because of my mom. Works. Holy shit. I'm gonna compare this to something. And I know if many of you like like mint and chocolate together. This tastes like a goddamn York peppermint patty. I had to move that. I got a fucking cut in the fucking... I don't know how. I got a freaking scratch right here on this side. I'm gonna get a mud jug whenever I can. I'm tired of pressing my lips to this nasty ass fucking bottle. Cause I've cleaned that fucker out. <clears throat> Hold on. I'm drinking one of these. And these things do not taste like Mountain Explosion. It just tastes like... Actually, it does taste like Mountain Explosion. It just... It tastes like fucking Mountain Explosion. It's just got no fucking fizz. Alright then. <laughs> I'm a little tired while doing this, so I'm not as energetic as I usually am. Forgive me. Oh, that's attractive. It was very attractive. Yuck. 
I hate that when you drink something and you go to spit, it's all stringy and shit. Here's some point. Cause I live at home in a trailer. God damn, that eight mile fucking movie was fucking hilarious in some parts and fucking stupid in the other. Why do people have to jump each other? Like, why can't you just fucking fight it out 1v1? Like, you really have to junk somebody to fucking show that you're a badass? No, that just shows you're weak and you need your fucking homeboys to back your ass up. If you need your homeboys to help you kick somebody's ass, you're a fucking pussy. You're weak. I don't need anybody to help me kick somebody's ass. If I get in a fight, it better be a fair fight or you can fuck off. Because if it ain't a fair fight, I'm pulling out a fucking gun and I'm capping everybody in the fucking area. Like, I'll cap all y'all motherfuckers. I am a fucking dead shot. Like, I'm the reason dead shot daiquiri was made, motherfuckers. Although my zombies gameplay and my fucking GTA gameplay and all that other shit I play doesn't really show. But with a real gun, you're fucked if I got you on my sights. I ain't missing for shit. And I'm gonna pop you right between the fucking eyes, bitch. But yeah, back to this. Um, this definitely is a good mint. And for the price that you would pay for this... Like, I literally, where I'm at, I live in Georgia, and this stuff is, like, dirt cheap. If you go to Dollar General in Georgia and get Stokers, guess how much I paid? Two-something. Not even three dollars. Two dollars and something-odd cents. Hell, I could have got a fucking whole roll of that shit. Five cans, bitch. <coughs> And to be honest, I love the cut of Stokers. Like, it's it's one of those things where these guys, or Stokers, used to be a chew. And if you look, you can tell by the cut that when you pull this out, it sticks together. Like, it sticks together so well. That's why I like Stokers. Stokers knows what he's doing. Now, Grizzly, on the other hand, they do make a good fucking wintergreen, so that dark premium wintergreen is going to be my everyday wintergreen. Stokers Mint is going to be my new everyday mint. I've not yet found a natural dip yet. And I've not yet found an everyday natural dip. But when I do, I'll let you know. If you guys enjoyed the video, like, comment, share it with a friend. Subscribe if you're new. Because as I said before, I upload daily. Unless, you know, family comes over and they want me to hang out, you know. Because I love my family. I love the fam, you know. So, oof. I hope that didn't come up on camera. <clears throat> Pardon me if it did, though. But, uh, yeah. I love being a juggalo. I love holding my hatchet proud. And if anybody tries to take it from me, you're gonna have to kill my ass first, pussy. You're gonna have to fucking kill me first. You want to take this hatchet? Bitch, you're going to have to put a bullet right fucking here before I give you a damn hatchet. 
Because you don't. I'm going to quote Cypher 17. The only way I'll ever bury this hatchet is deep in your neck when I end you. I'm going to hold that hatchet high and proud, and I'm going to scream whoop whoop at the top of my lungs from the top of the tallest fucking building. I don't give a shit. I'm going to be a juggalo to the day I fucking die. And I will ascend, bitches. If you strike me down, I shall become more powerful than you can ever imagine. Bitch. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see y'all in the next one. Hoi!